Hello, welcome to Evans Gardening on YouTube. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to make a homemade irrigation self-waterer. Hope you enjoy this video. What you will need, firstly, is a plastic 2-litre bottle. And secondly, you will need a screw-in hook. Now, you need to decide where you want to make your holes. This is where the water will drip out of, so you could hang this over a plant and make the holes in the bottom you could do them on the sides you can do them anywhere i'm choosing to do two holes right down at the bottom on each side so that it'll constantly drip even when there's low levels of water because the second hole will be right down at the bottom of this water bottle After, all of, after you've done all of that, you need to get yourself some garden string and as you, you hopefully you can see where my hole where the holes I've made are and I've done that on the other side. As I said, get yourself some of your garden string. You don't need a lot so you could always use off cuts. I'm just gonna get just get mine off the roll but it doesn't need a lot at all. Then what you need to do is line it up over the hole then using the hook, push the string into in through the hole that you've made making sure that you've pushed in about one or two centimeters of string into the bottle then you can cut it you could also leave it long and then push the other end of the string into the water into the soil and then it'll carry the water from the bottle into the soil but i'm just going to be just leaving it so it drips i'm going to be putting this in my pumpkin plant i'm going to put it down like that then the neck of the bottle i'm going to attach to the greenhouse then it's going to drip in my pumpkin it also helps to put up a shade in in front of the bottle and obviously in front of the where the soil is this will one stop the sun from getting to the water evaporating it quicker and it'll stop the sun from getting to the soil which will make it dry out quicker the water levels went down quite quickly, but because of the shading, the soil was moist for over five days and the plant remained in health for five days. So this is really good. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Have a great day. Goodbye.